Hello, it's been a minute since I picked up this camera. Excuse my appearance. I just finished my workout um, and it was a good one. Anyways, tonight I'm doing Asian. So, let's get to that. Oh, and I forgot to say, I'm doing a different theme each night this week because I felt like cooking and doing that. Now let's get to it. Chickens cooking in the wok per Ryan's idea. Charlie, are you excited for Asian night? How do you how do you feel about Asian stir fry night? You look tired, buddy. Okay. Hot. Oh, and it's fogging up because it's so hot. <laughs> When you open it, mm -hmm. it's actually quite warm because yeah, the other water's hot. <laughs> it's a little. That's how it comes out in the airplane, nice and steaming hot. And then you, <laughs> yeah, you wipe your fingertips, wipe your right? Yep. And you can put it on your face too, or like your mouth. Oh. You see it on the face, hot? Yeah. Oh yeah, I have. I just remember it being like. James, I'm not sure. If it's oh yeah, he told you. I think it's Shay Shay. Yeah. You want okay. To get the Asian night. Was a little bit. No, of I yeah. Okay, zero to ten, guys. What was the uh, rating? Pretty good. That's not a number. Okay. Um, eight. Okay. Alrighty, it's day two. Tonight's Mediterranean. We're doing a little salmon with veggies and homemade pita and tzatziki. So let's see how it goes. Alexa, pause. Alright, this is, <laughs> you can hardly see the salmon. This is the before. Got all kinds of veggies. Now it's time to go in the oven. Yeah, look how good that looks. Basically a gourmet chef. No. But I need to make sure it's cooked all the way because we don't want it to be raw. Alexa, pause. Okay, here are the pitas. They look okay. I don't... Hello. Except for... I was going to make tzatziki. We don't have cucumbers, so that's actually really annoying, because I was really looking forward to that. I'm like so hot right now. I guess we'll just have to come up with something else, or make do, I don't know. So guys, it's Mediterranean night. Here we have some salmon with lemon slices, olives, peppers, tomatoes, a uh, little bit of onion, a little bit of capers, a little bit of olive oil. Looks very good. Pita, which look sad as frick, but hopefully they taste good. Um, and then that's tzatziki. I had to look up a different recipe because we didn't have any cucumbers. So it might be disgusting because it's supposed to be made with Greek yogurt and that's <coughs> dairy-free yogurt, but it's if it's gross, okay. I'm not gonna be offended, so. Okay, what's your rating one out of 10, mother? And be completely honest. Don't sugarcoat it. Because like for me, I didn't really like the pita. It was too plain. I and the, the, salmon, the salmon was very good. I'd probably give it an 8. I like the pita, but I would give the pita maybe a 7. Just a I thought you were going to say a 4 for some reason. I know. It looks like it was not cooked, right? Yeah. It's like, it looks a little sketchy. It, it tastes good though. How I about you, Colin? Well, thank you. And I like the tzatziki. 
Hello, so it's day three of, I don't even know what I'm calling this, but we were going to do Belizean tonight um, and use a recipe for rice and beans from our um, Belize chef, but we don't have coconut milk, so or we're out of it so we're improvising and I don't really know what culture it's gonna be right now because it's not really Belizean anymore okay so oh there's on the phone we have some mini farfalle or um bow ties whatever you want to call it and then some tomatoes and onions sauteing in this pan and I'm gonna add spinach. This is gluten free linguine. We never we've never tried this brand before but they didn't have the kind um we normally get when whoever went to the store lost, I don't know. Um and then sausage is under there. So we normally when we do sauce oh my gosh I need to raise this up. So when we normally do sausage, we do chicken sausage, but um, when my mom went to the farm market, farmers, whatever you want to call it, when she went to go pick up the meat, um, they didn't have any chicken sausage. So this is pork. pissed because this was kind of a fail. Uh, I thought there would have been more tomatoes. I mean more liquid from the tomatoes. Sausage, tomato, onion, spinach, pasta obviously. And this is gluten free. I have, I pulled out some balsamic for a little bit more liquid but hopefully I kind of feel like it's going to be dry so kind of fail and I'm kind of frustrated. You want some other? Mm -hmm. I made a shark video Oh nice. Oh thank yeah, you. thank you. I haven't made one in so long actually. Yeah, but it's been a while, huh? Bam. We're just going to excuse my tragic appearance. I was really um, sweaty after my workout and then I'm um, trying to juggle with soccer ball. Um, like soccer juggling, not with my hands. And I got really hard doing that and then I was doing other things and I just am kind of disgusting. I look like I don't know what a shower is. But I'm going to shower after dinner. Anyways, I just wanted to explain. I was cutting up those potatoes. I kind of made like a potato crisp kind of thing. Um, where I slice them kind of thin and spread them out on a pan and put some olive oil. And then um, this black truffle salt. Um, so we'll see how it turns out. Um, uh... I don't know, I'll have to ask my family because I literally don't think I despise a food more than I despise potatoes. They literally like, you will never catch me, oh it's blurry, you will never see me eating um, a potato because I literally hate them, I think they're disgusting, um, but my family likes them so some potatoes and my mom's doing some chicken because I don't know how to cook a whole chicken I can only do it when it's like pieces or whatever you want to call them so that's that now I'm gonna cut up some veggies and saute those 
Got some Brussels sprouts going. Some rice and some chicken meatballs. And Dad's cooking some steaks outside, but I don't eat steak, so that's why I have chicken meatballs. Also, it's Mother's Day. Oh, thank you. So, so Dad made steak. Um, if you, well, I made turkey meatballs because that's what the recipe called for. Um, also, I don't eat steak, so this is like a lemon. Ooh, celerific. Wow. This is a <laughs> lemon rice and then Brussels sprouts. Yum. Sounds so. good.